welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Subnofka 19. Oh, don't I look awesome in this truck? Look at there. Except for the green hat. Should be a blue. Folks, how y'all doing? Y'all doing alright today? I got hung on my dolly jacks. I'm doing pretty good. I just hope y'all are doing great also. Uh, you're probably like, why didn't I dump that in there? Well, last episode, folks, we cut our beans. Uh, go check out that field, that field, and field one at top of our map. Uh, that's what I got. I got 8,995 liters of beans off of field one. But we was waiting on the prices to go up. Prices went up. So, uh, let me get this. Yeah, soybeans. Um, they are right here at bakery uh, $1,013 per thousand liters so I, that's quite a bit of money folks and also we got a couple of contracts to do um, so we'll be doing them and hopefully our sellage will be ready to haul and we got a that's all we got that's all we got in there. Oh man. Okay, let's let's see what else that uh, bakery will take for a high price. Let's see. Um, bakery. Um, we don't have. We don't have oats, canola, or sunflowers. We have corn, but it doesn't go to bakery. Look like it's going to go to transport or village grain elevator. Um, top price for. Oh, they changed it. Where'd the bakery go? Right here. Uh, okay, so bakery is not the top price. Only for soybeans, way it looks. Okay, um, so we're just going to carry these soybeans over there. Get our tarp to tr over this truck. And we are going to go to bakery, folks. I'm kind of going to... I need to cut through here, don't I? We got to get some fuel for this truck also. And, um... Yeah, we got... Um... Oh, we got ice demon up in our combine this morning um, over at field 33 doing oats, which is a contract. Hey, Jordan, if you're watching this and I'm driving the truck and I'm running the stop signs. Uh, I guess I can't complain about your speed in the last one. Jordan is my cousin, folks. Him and his wife, uh, Elsie. Whoa, whoa, slow down, truck. Slow. Oh. Okay, you only find that. You can only find that here at Mr. Blue. We wreck a truck and also hear my radio key up. <laughs> anyway, Jordan, Elsie. Uh, uh, Jordan's my cousin. Elsie's his wife good friend of mine also and uh, she's one that does ET designs that makes the face masks and stuff and her YouTube channel is down below uh, in the description if y'all want to go check that out and we are at bakery and let's see how much we get for this we got 44,000 so it should be almost 50,000 for this load why did I kill the truck all right, looks like that's going to take a while. So let's dive around to our bouncy tractor. Yeah, let's uh, go ahead and unload this straw. And that's going to take a while too. And here's our guy here. Uh, who did I say? Ice Demon. Ice Demon. Demon Demon. Uh, harvest income was 45242 for a load of soybeans. Woohoo! That is good. That's good. Uh, I gotta get down here and collect the straw. We're not worried about the uh, the uh, that one. I'm trying to think. 
We're not worried about the auger wagon because we're just going to use the truck. So let me get this truck over there and get some fertilizer going on the other contract. 28377 for the straw. We're almost, we're, folks, we're like seven or 8000 away from uh, being 100000 That's awesome. Uh, I gotta get to field. I gotta get to field 33, so I'll see you in a second. Roll it on up in this place like we own it. Well, technically we do because we own the game, right? <laughs> you're gonna see some unrealistic things, folks, and then, uh, if you like realism, uh, let me know how to try to start playing better. But sometimes I just like to get the job done no matter how fast we have to go to get it done like catching up with him so we can unload driving all over the straw hope it don't night fire all right we're gonna let that unload and uh be back in a second all right y'all probably hear the rain here in real life it's coming down pretty good um, of course, our farmers around here in real life really needs a rain. All right, good. Good ice demon has turned around. And uh, I wish we could hire a worker here. We could get Christy to drive this, but it's a special mine, so I won't hire a worker for some reason. But uh, that's okay. We're going to stop here. We're going to get this truck out of the way. Then we're going to go get on some fertilizing contracts and try to get them done. Alright, we're hooking this one up and looks like we do have herbicide in there. I'm going to check these things real quick and that is liquid fertilizer and both of them. Okay, so we may have to buy some more herbicide, not for sure. All right, I got the fertilizer spreader going. I got the herbicide spreader going. Um, got the combine going. I'm trying to get up some more of this straw wherever possible. And um, go ahead and shut my engine off. We'll go back over. Uh, he's almost half, so we got a couple more rounds. Here's the Pepper I. I don't have no YouTuber's name I, I don't think so. So here's the fertilizer, field 33, and this is field uh, 30. And so far, we have field 15 done. So we're going to collect that. And this is what we got going so far. Uh, we should have a transporting so I'm gonna get started on that while these are doing that uh, so I will actually what I want to do before we do any more contracts is to go in here and this is today's folks so far we got $22 for property maintenance property income is 4275 so far and Harvest income, what was that? Oh, wedge payment. Uh, duh. Okay. Um, down here we got harvest income, 78,000. Biogas plant income was 11,000. Contracts income so far is 1,000. And then we got the wedge payment of the workers. So um, 1.3, 1,340,000. And we're fixing payback. Because right now, the loan interest is eating me up. So, I'm going to leave about 8000 And you can see, here's where we got the new loan. Uh, it was 4452 Then I paid off some, so I brought it down to 3764 uh, And we're going to try to get it down as low as we can today. Because that loan interest is eating us up. Alright, this guy was done, so let's uh, 
spraying on 30 is complete so I'm gonna go ahead and finalize that since we got y'all here and our next one is fill 17 so here we go all right it's done on field 36 so let's see here we're gonna finalize that one and let's see harvesting spraying fertilizing so 29 25 and 11 which one's closest to us 11 is over there 25 and 29 they all cross the tracks or across the river okay that's going to take a bit be right back my famous words be back in a second all right i got the other guy on field 29 and this guy's 94 percent so i figured i'd take over and I like this sprayer because it's got the sprayer section control mod and the sprayer supports it so uh, that's what I like about it because if you can see hopefully that left boom over is not working that means I'm overlapping and it won't spray oh done we're done we're done yay um, barely got 377 liters left uh, reason why I'm using liters now instead of gallons and stuff is because uh, at least I, I hope I ain't got it on this mod uh, farming position or position farming whatever it's called uh, has an issue with the unit converter mod so if you're a PC farmer and uh, you're using those two you will have mod issues sooner or later uh, I just got him emptied so he's making another round got him caught up and yeah we, we, we get it done uh, this guy should be almost done we're gonna go ahead and complete that spraying contract uh, we do have a transport I need to do and we got fertilizer 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 and the harvest and as you can see a couple more that we probably won't do so when we get caught up to this um, got some animals and stuff we need to take care of and also we need to take care of our corn because it's almost ready I'm gonna let it get to this color and then they'll be ready so uh, yeah be back in a second and I'm done the transport contract and y'all probably like this ain't realistic should be using a bobcat or some kind of skid steer or something and y'all are right y'all are very right to be realistic I should be but I'm just this isn't the realistic series the one that's fixing to come out sometime in June um, probably the second week in June I don't quite know yet I'm try and get some videos stockpiled on it and so far I've only got one video made <laughs> I'm ready for the second video but I just ain't had time to record it yet and also Ryan putting them in here in an angle now, these three didn't go but I like to do the bottom ones like this first It's because I've been having issues with this trailer well this map in general if I go take this off and set it down sometimes it gets lodged in the ground and I can't get it out to move it to the thing the same with the trailer this bottom pallet like you can see the bottom of that but this pallet here might be because I got it turned wrong but usually you can't see the bottom and it, it's lodged or lodged into the bottom of the trailer so that's been giving me issues so instead of canceling medicine creek i'm going to uh probably cancel this series here my basically we done i i don't know really how to say it i'm just saying that this map's been giving me a lot of issues and I done messed up on field five with the ground two point something out of million dollars for the this field five and the surrounding areas of that field. Um, you know, I went in Giants editor and I 
edit it. Now, I thought I was doing it right, but I had it on the wrong field number. And um, you're supposed to do it with a field you already own, and I ended up doing a, uh, like field one. I've done the same thing with uh, that grassland edge I had there. Where's this? Yeah, right down here. So, that's the issues I've been having with this map and probably a few more. And this car parks right on the trigger. How do you expect me to get five pallets right there in that space when you're taking up half of it? Let's see, unstrap those. And I'm gonna see if it'll happen, but I'm gonna make sure I place these in the trigger. And I'm gonna try to see if the one in the uh, trailer will give me problems. It's usually this one, but like if I come off and accidentally drop the pallet like I just did, but it was on the pallet part, it would lodge in the ground. I've never had it done at this point, but yeah. Come on, we got one more pallet. Please don't do it to me. I, I don't know. Yeah, see? Watch this. I'm inside the trailer and I can't get this out. Right here. It should pick up. See, it picks the whole trailer up. It's lodged into that pallet. I mean, into that trailer. So this is why I'm going to be doing away with this series pretty soon. See? Everywhere, you see over anyway, vehicle info is the moose mow it trailer. But my hand's on the pallet. You can see it try. I can scoot it by throwing it, but I can't pick it up. Usually I have to save the game or do some kind of weird stuff like this to get it come out. And this ain't fun. Hello, ma'am. How you doing? Don't don't pay no attention, Mr. Blue. I'm trying to get this pallet out. If I hit that throw and grab button a lot, sometimes I can get it unlodged, but it just I'm picking up the whole trailer. And I just barely put like right there. It still registers the trailer instead of the pallet. So, anyway. Back over here getting some of this straw up. The combines uh, probably get unload here in the second when it gets a little bit past the truck there. Hopefully I have time to turn around on the end. <clears throat> sometimes I use GPS on this. Sometimes I don't. Uh, these shorter fields, I don't really have to, but can I make it to the truck? Can I make it to the truck? Oh, it caught GPS. I think I left the truck running so I can just hop in and take off. Get to it before, before the combine gets to the end. Put your pipe out, sir. Thank you. There we go. Let him empty. I'll run back here real quick. Uh, probably need to check on our other guys. I know, uh, well, the herbicide uh, uh, tractor is, isn't going. That's done. I just got a couple more fertilizings done. So I'm probably going to go ahead and get this field done and then come back when I'm all done. You know. That way y'all can see the end results of this mission or contract, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I got the pallet out finally without having to save and exit the game. This is where I usually put the pallets in this trailer. They don't stick to the bottom like that. So uh, uh, the combine, I, uh, Demon quit on me and I had to rehire him. Uh, he's in the corner of field 33 now working 
uh, got old Christy in field 25 there spraying it. We got field 11 to go. Uh, I decided to go ahead and do this contract while they're working. I got to take it a little side of bakery up there. And um, I'll be back in a little bit. We're going to try to make this under 30 minutes this time. All right, folks, we made it up here to the bakery to drop off the uh, oats. Um, we had quite a bit, a little over 30,000 something there. And uh, we have 18,154 now. I'm just going to go ahead and sell the oats here. There you go. Contract field 33 is finished. And we're fixing to have a harvest income of 8201 So, yeah, $26,000 now. So, I'm going to go ahead and pull off the scales here, and, uh, yeah, this trailer's kind of wrong. We're going to try to switch over. Well, we're not going to try. We are going to switch over to the straw. And go ahead and dump that out. And while we're doing that, um, the combine's here ready on field 10 for rye. Uh, harvest contract 33 is now finalized for $5,816. No slice transport. Uh, fizzed out. Fertilizing on field 11. Field 25 fertilizing. Field 29 fertilizing. Which brings us down to our... Oh, I thought it was right. It's oats in field Oh wait, 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 we got two two more. Okay, there's the rye in field ten. And we just got that and then. And that's uh potatoes, that's uh two belling contracts. Now it'd probably be worth doing this one, because it's eleven thousand uh, dollars. I'm gonna do that off screen and it won't be today because I got some things I gotta take care of. But we are going to do this in here on 10 so we're going to accept that and we're going to go ahead and get somebody working on this uh whoa why are you putting your pipe out try that again all right folks we uh, <laughs> uh yeah, yeah. It won't let me put it back in either. Okay, we have a mod issue. All right, we are up here. I brought this tractor up here to pick up something because the green tractor dropped off this and, and that's the fertilizer sitting in front of it. This is a conveyor belt that we bought in the last episode. It's a, a Stevie mod. That's so going to work pretty good. But let's uh, sell this and get our new item that we're going to do. Uh, can we customize? We still can't customize. All right, $13,705. We're going to repair for $35. Brings it $13,748. Y'all do the math and tell me if it's better to repair or sell it as is. And I'm selling it for $13,748. And sold to the man in the front row. We are at $80,000 now, folks, again, again, but we are going to order, now probably like, what am I going to fertilize with? Well, there's a new mod, by, or it's been out for a while, it's Stevie. I would get this one, but it's only doing 12, and this one does 16 mile an hour at 24, that one's 36, it is better, but... I don't know, most of the fields are small, so I'm going to go with this one. And that does, does fertilizer, it don't do lime. This one does fertilizer and lime, so that's a good good deal there. Let's go in factory new. Oh, we can up it. Let's up it to uh, 20 is too fast. Let's go with 18. 18.1. That's about average 16 to 18 mile an hour around here but it's not this kind of buggy but yeah so um that's ordered oh whoa he said he had to order it it's already here man john moves fast 
Okay, that's, good. that's going to be put on that tractor to get it back to the shop. We have a new toy here also that I bought in the last episode. I don't know if I showed it or not. But instead of doing soil samples, we are going to do crop sensor samples. This thing is supposed to, supposed to analyze the ground. Oh, oh, I'm on the wrong one. Get on the front. Unfold. Probably help if I zoom in. Um, probably have to let it down, but yeah, it's got crop sensors on it, um, which I only see sensors on the outside, so it's supposed to tell us what our soul's about, so we're going to give it a try in the next episode, because the next episode, I guess I need to unfold that so the wheels will be right, there we go. Get this out of the way. All right, be right back, folks. All right, I'd like to have a little bad incident there. Come out to the end here to get some straw that was already here. See, this hasn't been cut right here, and there's some straw right here. That's a different type of straw. It's like soybean or corn straw or something. And I saw it change to, I think it was corn straw. And, uh, yeah, we got regular straw in here right now for rye, and uh, it, it, which it changed back to rye as soon as I got back in this, but well, almost full grain tank. Ooh. But anyway, folks, that's going to be this episode. It's 27 minutes on my end, give or take for the uh, intro and outro. Um, all I got to say is, folks, I appreciate it. I love y'all. Y'all are awesome. Y'all rock. All the above, y'all just amazing. And um, happy Memorial Day! I almost forgot. This should come out on the 31st, which is a Monday, and uh, Memorial's Day. All right, good. And uh, so, happy Memorial's Day to y'all, and also happy Fix and Be first of June. Uh, tomorrow, when y'all seeing this. It'll be tomorrow, which is June the 1st, so happy June. And I'll probably either start on the 7th or the 14th, somewhere in between there with the new map. I, I think I want to make a couple more episodes on this map. Um, maybe one more work episode so we can get... I want to go till the loan's paid off. We get the loan paid off, and then we're going to move and go somewhere else. And that'll be the new series when it starts. So, yeah. So, folks, y'all have a great day. And, uh, oh, I forgot, I forgot. Go down below in my description. Check out the other awesome YouTubers that's down there. And if you're new, check the comments while you're here. Check the comments. Leave a comment. Check out. The reason why I say check the comments is because there's other YouTubers that I can't put in my description box because the box is almost full. So, check the comments. They'll be in there. If you see somebody that's already left a comment, they're one of my family members, friends, or my YouTube family. So, be sure and check them out because they're awesome. Just like you're awesome. Check out my camera light. Uh, my can crusher. Which I'm going to try to work on a video on that. And folks. Y'all just have a, a wonderful day. And put a smile on your face. Not only your face. But make somebody else smile. You know. Life is short. And we need more happiness in this world. With what's going on and stuff. So, folks, having said all that, I'm out of breath. It's hot. It's been raining outside, but I'm hot because I got to shut the air off because y'all can't hear me if I'm talking. And I'm going to quit rambling. So y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And I will see you later. Bye.